Hello everyone. My name is Sisi and I'm from DNP. And uh, yeah, we DNP we are pro protesting here in Nago office for the past uh, 30 days. It's been a month. We are fighting against the life uh, about our life. Actually, uh, uh, when we talk about life uh, for the citizens of India, it is our fundamental rights and right to live. It's our, in Article 21. It's enshrined in our uh, Constitution, Article 21. So we have the rights to fight for our, our right. And here I wanted to mention one thing. I wanted to mention very clear is that uh, the NP. We are here in Nako office not to do somebody's work. We are here claiming for our rights. Uh, right to we have the right to access to treatment because uh, this ARV is a life li uh, lifeline medicine. It's a treatment uh, which in, in which many life in India is depending on it. And when we have a discussion in with the NACO officers, we are not claiming or blaming or uh, uh, fighting anybody. We are fighting for our, our rights. That I wanted to make it very clear because uh, when we talk to the officers, they were asking us for a solution that we are not here to provide them a solution we are demanding because we exist that is why they exist and as a citizen of india when we are taking a responsibility or a job it is our and it is our own responsibility to, to, to let our work done instead of blaming others or instead of blaming the process we need to do our work then where we are planted, not to, to, to point at fingers at others that will not let our work done. As a community, we are here because the, the concern authority is not doing their job. And yeah, we admit the fact that we are improving. The program is improving. There is a progress uh, when we see from the starting of uh, the program that is 2004. It's been 17 years. And yes, uh, they also stated the fact that a developed countries like US do not have a perfect health system. That is not an excuse to India which have who have a fundamental right to life. So, which means by stating the uh, or comparing the other countries with our own countries and trying to justify our uh, irresponsibility cannot be justifiable to the people who whose life is depending on and there is nothing wrong to a person to an individual who is fighting for their for their life and they are not trying to create an enemy. They are not cry trying to fight a person or an individual. Instead, they are fighting for their own 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 uh, own rights. That is right to live. And here, uh, one thing that I really wanted to mention here is that uh, we everyone in India is equal. There is no first class or citizens, uh, uh, first class citizens or second citizen. Whether you are infected, whether you are healed, whether you are not infected, so uh, everyone is equal. That is why uh, the right to equality uh, that should be really applied in every corners of our life. As a citizen, we should not uh, discriminate or we should not humiliate others based on their health, based on their uh, uh, looks, or based on their status. So. Uh, that is where we really need to be practical and to someone it may be their job but uh, to, to the community it's their life doing a job and fighting for a life is really a different because just because you do not do your job diligently or uh, uh, honestly that can affect a millions of life so let's be uh, very responsible as a citizens of India and let's be very responsible and honest to our job so that we are, we are a blessings to others, not then a, 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 a someone, a threat, a threat to others' life. Thank you so much.